Detroit Windsor Railway Tunnel, also known as the Michigan Central Railway Tunnel. Let's watch a Canadian Pacific arrive from Canada. Here is a similar model of the Lionel Canadian Pacific. Canadian Pacific Railway Map of North America. Under the Arthur Bagley Street here. And there comes one of those uh, gravel things again. He's up that hill, he's losing speed. Yeah. You want to jump on? That's a long train for just one engine. Yeah. Just no, that was a, there, there were two engines on it. Oh, was there? Yeah, oh, there was okay. two. Now, I wonder if these car cars are full of cars. You know, they build cars in Windsor and they bring them over. Chrysler's got a big plant in Windsor where they build cars. Are they full? So Ray's telling me these uh they got his cars on. He's, he's got a big big load depth, two engines and come up the steep incline. That's always Yeah, this train would still be in Windsor the other end of it. If it's a mile long. Was back in uh, around 1980, they had to make this tunnel taller. So you know, you know, there's two portals there. The one on the left is the only one they use because the new modern trains with the, with the double stack cargo things and these big uh, auto racks, they, they had to make it taller. They had this one and they ground it all down. Yeah. They, they made it deeper and taller. It took them about a year and a half. You can, you can YouTube it. There's a, there's a video about how they how they did it. Yeah. They probably uh, have good rail under the bridge there. Oh yeah, there is. It's on. It's on uh, concrete uh, ties. Yeah. Oh, okay. Now there's talk about when they finish this Michigan Depot here, him, or not Henry Ford, but William Clay Ford. He's trying to negotiate with Via Rail in, in Canada to run a train from here to Toronto. And the passenger train will go through this tunnel. The concern is the carbon monoxide. Are the exhaust fans good enough to keep it clear for passenger cars? So the, the, between Amtrak and Via Rail, the goal is to set a, set a deal. You, you could board a train at the new Michigan Depot and go to Toronto. Wouldn't that be cool? I would do that. Yeah, could be, yeah. Can you see the engine still? Or is out of sight? I think I see the last car coming. I want to 
does not six mean? The word not six, does that mean anything? Yeah, it's, uh, they have eight notches, it's wide open. Well, okay. And six is three quarters. There's a guy on YouTube calls himself not six. Yeah, so he's almost wide open there. And, and, uh, you ever hear the term eyeball? They be going a little fast? Give it all you got. Yeah, give it all you got, yeah. It's all fast, so you get it going. But keep all the wheels down, huh? That means open it wide open. Got no choice, he's gotta make it, man. Yeah, yeah. Alright, I'm over here at the Detroit Windsor uh railroad tunnel. I'm still over here still talking to Ray, and he's giving me all the scoop on uh how the railroad works. And he lives close by. Now you drove over here, right? Yeah, yeah. And you're over at uh where was it, Bagley's? Uh I'm at Honey Bee Market. I yeah, the uh, guacamole and hummus for lunch. That's where I parked it. I parked at a Honey Bee Market too. Yeah. Went inside, got a little snack, and then here I am. We make your own hummus. Oh honey yeah. Bee. That's some and good stuff. I'm gonna make my own guacamole. And I got some good bread I got at home. Hey, food. I'm kinda lazy. I go to Taco Bell. <laughs> <laughs> so Alright, Ray, I'm gonna sign off here. You got my business card. Okay. I may use this on Departing YouTube. Departing the United States from Detroit, Michigan to Windsor, Ontario. Blows that arm, we're, we're getting knocked off this bridge. Well, maybe not under a bridge. Uh, Detroit Windsor Railroad Tunnel. I just met Ray here. He's retired from Great Lakes Steel and he was a locomotive engineer there for 37 years and he's going to show us some of the famous hand signals. All right, show us your signals. Back when they used signals, this is a stop, this is a washout. Okay. That means stop quick and uh, this is a backup, backup. Okay. This, this is a come ahead. All right. And this is a tie them up. This is head for the barn. That means take it to the, and this is tie up. Tie up, kind of like a, almost like a boat, huh? I got tied up, huh? Yeah, yeah, tie up. Uh, now you were saying you started there, there were 12,000? 12, 12,000 people at uh, Great Lakes Steel, and when I retired, 900. So they, they cut uh, manpower quite a bit. Okay. In uh, 37 years. Listen, nice meeting you, I'm Gary, okay. and I'm from Milford, Michigan. Take care. And I've been in Detroit most of, most of my time. I lived in Auburn Hills and Ypsilanti, and I yeah. come back. You know, I inherited my house on Dragoon Street. Got it. In Detroit, so I'm back home. I was raised here. Yeah, I was. I was born. I used to live on Joy Road in Grand River. When I was a kid. Oh, yeah. And I was born. I think it was uh, Hutzel Hospital as a kid in one, one of those hospitals downtown. Hutzel. Hutzel, I think it was. Yeah. But it had a different name before that, though. Yeah, I lived on Joy Road in Southfield for a while. I had an apartment there back in the late 60s. Yeah, there might be a train coming. Look who's coming through the, the security here showing up for... for uh... And did you know if, if a train... If you you can stop a train as, a, as not a, a, a non-worker, they have to stop if you, you know, swing your arms violently. Like, wow. They have to stop. They'll stop if you want them to stop, you know. I don't plan on doing that, man. Yeah. This is unless my unless my F one fifty is stuck on the tracks. <laughs> yeah, but I watch them sometimes. They'll get a run at it, uh, to make it up the hill here. Right. And sometimes they get stuck. A lot of times they'll be going real slow. They got to drop the sand then, you know, drop some sand. Okay. To get some traction. Yeah, I think we got a train coming. That's that's what you just we just saw the uh, border patrol go by. Usually they kind of watch the trains that comes through. Yeah, for sabotage. Sabotage and people hanging on the boxcars or whatever. 
You know, there's a place in Wyandotte uh, we watch the trains sometimes on Oak Street, and uh, they go pretty fast by there, you know. Oak Street and what crossroad? Uh, near, uh, Fort, between 4th Street and Southfield on okay. Oak, Oak Street. All right. And they, a lot of train watchers uh, stop there and watch the trains. Yeah, I'm a, I'm a YouTuber. So, all right. Uh, good, good, good seeing you. I'm going to cut her off here. Okay. Nice all talking right. to you. Take care. Head for the barn. Have a nice walk and head to the barn. Please smash that like button, subscribe, and ring the bell to get all the notifications from YouTube. And as always, share some Detroit and Mackinac Railway. This is Train Room Pam. This is Train Room Gary. Thanks, Thanks for, for watching. watching. Please check out these fine videos from my YouTube channel.